Hey everyone, I'm Barb Dibwad here for Tekka TV. And today we're doing Just Show Me, where we take your gadgets and give you tips and tricks for how to get the most out of them. Today we're going to look at how to arrange tiles on your Windows Phone 7 home screen. Let's fire up our device here. And on your home screen, you'll see these square icons that are called tiles. And in order to add a new tile to your home screen, you'll want to click on this arrow here at the top right and get your list of all the apps that are on your phone. So let's say that I think I'm going to be using calculator quite a bit. All you need to do is long press on this calculator icon here in the list and you get a menu option that's called pin to start. That means pin this item to your start screen. So if you click that button, we're taken back to our home screen and we see that the calculator is here at the bottom. Now, if calculator is very important to you, you might want to move it to the top of the list. And the way that you do that is long press on the calculator tile. And you'll see the other icons kind of fade away into the background. And you'll get a little pin icon at the upper right of the tile that you're still holding down. All you need to do is move it to the location you want. So let's put it at the top here. I'm a real math nerd. I love calculating. And once you're done, just click anywhere else on the screen and you'll be taken back to your regular home screen. Now, if you want to get rid of something on your home screen, it's a very similar process. Let's say that I don't use this AT&T Navigator very often, so let's take that one off. Again, you want a long press. Everything else fades into the background and you've got your pin icon here at the upper right. To get rid of this one, just click on that pin icon and it'll disappear, leaving you a blank spot for something perhaps more important on your home screen. So that's all you need to know about how to arrange the tiles on your Windows Phone 7 home screen. And I'm Barb Dibwad. This has been another edition of Just Show Me.